What is up guys, Photo Fever here and welcome back to another Tuesday two minute tutorial. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how you can take your daytime photos and turn them easily into a nighttime shot simply by using a few adjustment layers in Photoshop. And I'm gonna start right now. Right guys, so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and just choose a photo. And today I have chosen this photo, which again guys, I got off of unsplash.com. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use three adjustment layers to create this effect. So firstly, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead to our bottom right hand corner to our adjustment layers icon. And this time we're gonna go ahead and select color lookup first. Now color lookup is a way of creating lookup tables within Photoshop. And you've got a few free presets that Photoshop gives to you when you go ahead and actually download Photoshop. So what we can do is to access them, we're gonna go through our 3D LUT files, we're gonna to click to load 3D LUT, and this time we're gonna go, go all the way down and we're gonna choose the free one here called nightfromday.cube. And we'll go ahead and place that over the photo. And as you can see, it changes how the colors are represented onto the photo and it creates a really cool realistic look. But for most cases, this is quite a dark effect. So there's a few ways of getting around this. You can either turn down the opacity, which again affects the brightness, but this time I'm actually going to show you a few extra effects to make this effect look, look more realistic. So what we're gonna do is go down to our bottom adjustment layers again, guys, and this time we're gonna go ahead and select curves this time. Now, instead of brightening the entire photo, we're just going to affect the highlights. So we're gonna go to our highlight section or our white in the top left-hand corner, and we're gonna go ahead and drag that over to the left-hand side. And as you can see, it's brightening the photo while still keeping the darkness and a lot of the very dark places in the shadow areas, which is cool, and this is good, and that's what we want. And then the last effect, I wanna make it just an ever so slight, a little bit more cyan-y blue instead of this very dark blue. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our adjustment layers again, guys, and then we're gonna go ahead and choose Photo Filter. Now in Photo Filter, we can go ahead and choose from a warming filter, so we're gonna select on that, and then we're gonna drop it down to Cooling Filter 82. And then what you can do is you can reduce the density of this to around 15%. Lovely, so what I can do now is show you the before, which is quite nice, and then show you the after, and it looks like this was now shot at nighttime by changing the type of photo from the color balance and creating this really cool effect. And there we go, guys. If this video helped you out, make sure to give it a like, and also subscribe for more tutorials just like this one. You can find my latest two minute tutorials just here, and my latest videos just down here. But until next time, guys, keep creating.